Hello guys and welcome back to Empyrean. Um This is not a let's play, this is um, what I promised. <coughs> We're going to check out at um, the Crashed Hyperion. Um, I've never done this um, creative uh, place before. I've done creative on Omicron, I've done creative on Akua. I've never done it in orbit. So this is what you get. Um, gravity generator, bit of power, and you get this little ship, whatever this is. Rocket launcher at the front, Gatling guns, four Gatling guns, Christ. Don't believe in uh, short measures, do they? Looks like a bit like a jet really, doesn't it? <coughs> anyway, stick our jetpack on. Let's fly away from here because we don't want uh, gravity. Gravity will just destroy the Hyperion. Uh, we don't want to be anywhere near really anything because I don't know how big this thing is in relation to all of this. So I think we're away from the platform enough. Right, F2. Crushed Hyperion. Contains forbidden blockers, wrong version. Yeah, it's the same as one of my ships. It's from an old version when I made it. Right, so this is it, guys. This is the Hyperion. For anybody who didn't realise you could do that, by the way, yeah, um, that's how I dug out so called dug out the tight the Titan. I basically just stuck a core uh on each section and saved it to my blueprints, then went into creative. It's still classed as a base, as you can see, base. Um and I had to copy it block by block to create um the capital ship that I've actually got. So this is the ship. Um, pressing H will bring up all your blocks. I'm going to give us ourselves a torch. Um, so we can have a good look around it. So I'm presuming this is the back. Uh, it'll be these guns that have... Um, they'll be the, the forbidden blocks. Um, yeah, I'm presuming this is the back. It's got the engines at the back. Um, let's have a look at the outside first. We'll have a quick look around. Yeah, there's a lot of these uh, plasma guns or something, what they're called. Soon find out. We'll get ourselves a... Um, where is it? Look at two. Pointed at it. It's an ion cannon uh, planet. I don't think they're actually uh, in the game now, or if they are, it's a different model. It's like it's not that doesn't look like that. Um, this is the outside. It is a big, big ship. Big ship. So let's say we've got a couple of loading bears on the side. Let's get back to our torch. So we've got a couple of loading bays on the side. Um, or maybe it's not loading bays, I don't know. This would be for a very small vessel, as I would have thought. Um, some type of quick enter exit. Um, like kind of mini launches. Uh, I would have thought that they would actually launch them, but then again, I would have said they would launch them out the back way, but there, you've got that there as well, so. It would be um, kind of launch and get the hell out of there. Maybe it's launch up that way. Uh, you got these arms coming out. By the look of it, they've got thrusters on as well. Let's see, if there's one on the other side with a thruster on it. Oh, two thrusters on that side. So that's what will have gone over there. Yes, it's going to take some doing to recreate this one. Um, and then we've got these all over the place, these power things, um, 
don't really remember the when we first entered. On the other side, um, there was a hole in the floor. Uh, there was one along it. Oh, there it is. Yep, and there's one on the other side of there. Let's look back outside. Um, at the front, yeah. I'm still thinking of going with the um, like a domed, rounded front, because there's no front on it whatsoever. It's definitely had a thruster there, though. Um, yep. So do that. In game, uh, white chests means there's something in them. Blue chests means they're empty. Um, so when we go back to episode 7 uh, I'm going to go back up to the Empyrean at some point and search all these chests there's what, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 7 in this room 7 in that room uh, 1, 2, 3, 4 in that room there's 11 quite a lot of chests, do see some more? they're all blue uh, blue. So there's 11 chests. Oh, what's that in there? Um, to loot. Huh, lounge area. Another lounge area. Yeah, I was hoping to start from the top, actually. That just caught my attention, though. Sorry about that. So we start from the top of this ship. Oh, it looks like that was the top. Doesn't look like we can get any higher than that. Again, this is going to be so hard to recreate the front because I haven't got a clue what the what the front was supposed to look like. Big long passageway in there. Passageways, passageways. Lots of passageways. Uh, again, at the bottom, there doesn't seem to be anything here. It's maybe it's just part of the whole structural um, support. But we start at the bottom. So, we've got two rooms to the side. Uh, looks like observational type rooms or something. Well, I can't believe the size of this thing. Um, there was the passage in the middle. That's the only thing with uh, space, but when you're floating about it, very quick. Um, yep, same room that side. And that takes us down. Stand up, stand up. So that takes us to here, and we can walk down here. And then it's a dead end. So I don't know what was in here, but they look like windows. <coughs> so let's get back out of this one. We go to the next. We'll try and go to the next level up. So this is the next level up. Um, it looks as if this could be the floor. Maybe that was a wall or something. These were rooms. Looks like there's something there, like a room type thing there. No, maybe it's just again structure. Um, so this is definitely a passageway though. Uh, into these rooms. Again windows, you can see over into the engine bits there um, or the, I don't know what they would be called trailing arms so that's this way is that a doorway go into another room lots of storage areas, that's a bit certain let's get back out here um, go into this side, it's exactly the same again Uh, totally disoriented myself. Let's get back out here. Right, so continue along the passage. Well, that's obviously into where they were. Yep. Right, so we can do that. Um, and then we go down the passageway. Oh, growing area. A lot of growing plots. 
No light in the um, in the roof though, so okay. Is there anything up there? Oh. Looks like this could have been a um, a lift shaft. Be interesting to put put this thing back together. Oh, more areas. Oh, no, this is where we came in, wasn't it? And I uh, took out. Yeah, there's the hole that came up, popped up there, and I took them out, didn't I? So are these lift shafts as well? Yep. Definitely look like it. So I'll continue through the centre of the ship. This brings me. Yep, there's the entrances to the uh, the walk through bits there. So we're gonna have to go one of them. I keep bumping into things, and uh, I want to get into one of them and see if I can get round it. So this is where I put my car, as you can see. Um, without that car, it wouldn't be anything. If I took it out, oh, excuse me. If I took it out, uh, I wouldn't be able to re um, respawn it. So this basically stops here. It's just um, a circular, um, circular passage, really. So let's have a look at this from outside. So yeah, it's, uh, it's a circular passage all the way around there. And the core, if I remember correctly, was in the middle. We had to go up the stairs, didn't we? So if we go up the stairs, and the core was in here. As the that's where the core was. So a lot of girders in the middle with them funny looking um turrets around it. Uh shame I couldn't save the turrets. So and there's the energy generators. Wow. Oh and we've got a gravity uh, generator below us. So I'm presuming all of this is going to be um, one platform with a platform with stairs. Excuse me, um, down to here. And no way down to the bottom. I think that's supposed to be just sealed off. So yeah, that would all be sealed there. We've got. Um, these along there, kind of like railings, um, so we could come down, check these out, and then have to go back up the stairs and off we go again. So, but we couldn't go any further on the ground floor, so we've come to this level. We might as well go back to the front of the ship, walking this way, um, and then come back through. There's these turrets everywhere. This would make for a hell of a PvP um, cruiser, battle cruiser type thing. Um, oh, what's this? Again, another turret. Oh, there's another chest there. I've got to remember all these. I should write this down. So chest, oh, chests there, white ones as well. No turret in this room. Christ, you wouldn't want this live, would you? Um, turrets would just rip it to shreds before you'd even start it. Another big, big growing area. Another turret. That'll be that, um, yeah. That's down the ones below, yeah. Wow. There's that arm above us, the trailing arm for the front of the ship. Coming off the front of the ship. Um, more either storage, living quarters, um, but whatever. Another turret. Some steps down to below. This is going to be good building this. It's going to be hard. Uh, I'll <laughs> I'm not going to lie to you. Uh, it's going to be very hard. Yeah, these are them. Um, crates. Wow, wow. 
I still haven't finished uh, the Titan yet. Um, I've rebuilt it. It's in one solid piece, but I'm trying to furnish it out. Uh, I'll give you a quick look of it anyway on here. I'll put it next to this and show you this sheer size of this thing, because this is absolutely huge. Um, I bet this takes some uh, some resources to build. So again, yeah, that was probably a uh, walk with uh, like um, a full platform there. Maybe this was the bridge. Um, or whatever. Bear in mind, this is going to be covered in, isn't it? So maybe it's not. I don't know. Uh, I didn't design and make this thing. Um, yep, there's our seating areas. So there's our areas for a bit of R&R. Let's get in here, if I can. Looks like this is an observation type deck area. Um, full on windows. Oh, we're outside. Well, there's a, that fuel tank that we mentioned earlier. So I would presume there would be a door there. I want to get in there. Um, and I'm thinking it's going to be the same on the side. Let's have a quick look. Yep. Where's that bit? There's the doorway. Yep. And there's a fuel tank. So this is as far up as this section we can go. Let's go back down there. Checked all that. Let's go further up. Um, right, so that stops dead there. Uh, we can come round here. More seating areas. Um, it's probably been all blocked in this. This is a yep, just a lounge area. Another turret. Love the turrets. Yep, another one. Uh, me falling over again. Right, let's get back down to the core area because that's the only way onwards towards the back of the ship now. Um, still haven't found a bridge. Um, let's go around there, spin round, let's go across here, duck down there, spin round again, oh god, oh hello, right what's up here, um, ah we'll leave that, that for now, we're staying on this level aren't we, right jump over, Ah, I think this was just the back anyway, wasn't it? Where we couldn't go any further. So, yeah, that's where it come up. Couldn't get any further under there. But we can get this way. Right. Let's see what's out here. Oh, we can go down there, though. Right, we'll check this deck out first. Whoops. Come on, stand up. Further back. Whoop, what's in here? Sleeping areas, right? You now we've got the sleeping quarters. Um, there's a bed, lounger, big TV. Oh yeah, it's definitely a living quarters. This we've got a toilet. What's a shower? Um, a bathroom area. Oh, I'm getting stuck. Through here. Uh, yep, same as both sides. Let's have a look down here. I'm going to be missing bits out here at this rate because um, it's, uh, it's a bit of a maze really. Oh, what's this? Shower block? Yep, all shower. What's that? Is that a shower? Yep, showers. So I presume. Hey, what's that up there? What's that? Oh, it's the gun. It's the gun. Um, I'm presuming them two separate rooms will be the captain's quarters um, and his second in command, and this would be for the rest of the crew. 
It's just showers, showers, showers. So I don't know where the, the rest of the crew would live exactly. But this is just a, um, seems to be a shower block. Let's get back out of here. We need to get some power in there, really, so we can get these generators working. Uh, the gravity generators, maybe. Go back down this way. Yeah, that's that way. Right, let's go down this way. We haven't been down here yet. What's down here? See, this could be the room. Um, that will be a load of bunks in. This is where the guys bunk down for the night. Uh, I'm not sure. Um... If I do recreate this ship, I'll put it back on Steam, um, as is, um, and then refitted, exactly what I'm going to do with the Titan. Um, the Titan will be basically empty, um, and then it's up to you to refit it yourself in any way you want. So let's go up here. Oh, getting stuck. Wow. Oh, right. Now we're getting into control rooms and stuff. What's these? Ah, constructors. Different types of constructors. Uh, I'm wondering if that's the original uh, model for the original constructors. And there's another one. So a few of them in here. Yep, we've got another two there, another one there, another one there. Let's see what's through here. We've got another room. Another bathroom area. Another, maybe it's a officer's quarters or something. Oops. Uh, same through there, I presume. Yep. Um, down the sides. Um, and it looks like we're at the back of the ship. Let me look up. What's in here? Nothing. Stairs. Stairs leading. Oh, God. Come on. Stairs leading down. Anything through there? There's turret over here. Oh, this is the uh, bathroom area that I'd looked at earlier on. So, um, is there anything else further up? It's a bit annoying when you hit something that you go flat up against it. Uh, right, let's have a look along here. So we're at the top of this part of the ship. Oh yeah, we've seen that, didn't we? Yeah, we've seen all of this. Let's pop up here. Let's have a look and see what's up here. <sighs> More R and R. Oh come on! And that, that looks the same over that side. See, so yeah, we're back here again. So let's uh, head back this way. We go down. Go down here. I think that's about everything we've seen now, isn't it? Can we go further down? Yeah, I think that's as far down as we can get in that section. So we'll head back this way. Oh no, oh no, let's go down here. There's nothing down here. Up oh, there is. There's a hole there. I'm getting myself lost now. It's that big, this ship. It's uh, it's quite easy to lose yourself, right? Oh, what's this? Right. Tell you what, I'm going to see if I can get... Um, uh, 
Can we power the ship up? There's no gravity. Um, we've got gravity generators, but no gravity itself. Um, it says air gravity is on. So if I turn my jetpack off. Uh, why didn't I think of that before? So let's have a look up here. Ah, this is one of them bears. Um, but s small vessel fit in here? I'm not too sure. Let's have a look at that. Let's have a look up there. Right, so... Something definitely up there. So that would be an elevator, I would presume. Might have to use our jetpack to get up there and pretend it's an elevator. So is that the same the other side? Yep, exactly the same this side. And there should be a big op. Yep, there's a big opening. Right, so let's see what's along here. Um, inside here. Some stairs, take it up there. Have we seen this section before? More quarters. It's just a bed there though. Desk, TV. So there's uh, lots of room. I'm just trying to figure out why there would be a lot of... Oh, another turret. Why there would be so many... Um, oh. Where'd I come out of there? There. Um, why there would be so many showers? Um, I think I'm upside down. Am I upside down? Yeah, I'm upside down. Right, take that off. Tell you what. Um, H. Just get some blocks and f fill that in for a start. So I don't fall back out again. Right, let's have a look in here. Doorways to get out. And another fuel tank. That's pretty much all we can look at this side. Um, got a passageway going up. Is this where we come from? I am so lost. Oh, is this our shower room again? Yeah, we're back at the shower room. So, yeah, it looks like that's the back of it. Right, so let's get back to the centre core. Um, oh, I think that was through here. Right, there's the core. Uh, I think there's only these ladders now. We have steps we need to go up now. So this is, looks like it's the the bit that goes over the top of this centre dome section. So this could be the bridge. Let's have a look. Wow. Yeah, that goes back down to the other side, doesn't it? Yep, it is. It's the uh, the circular bit, this. So let's go up here. Right, we've got control. Yep. Oh, got more crates in the middle here. Wow. Loads and loads of crates to search. Yeah, I would say this is definitely the... Um, this is the control center of this gigantic ship. Um, there's no actual control chair. What's this? What's that? That's a console, right? Decoration. Um, so yeah, there you have it, guys. This is the uh, Hyperion, as discovered on the moon of Omicron. Yeah, it's just another deco. Um yeah. Awesome. Absolutely awesome. Um stick my jetpack on, let's go outside. Right, this is the size of it. Yeah. Uh, I still think that that's the front. 
that's the back right this is the size of this I'll show you quickly show you the um, the Titan of a fully built Titan to work in progress um, F2 uh, recovered this is the recovered Titan um, as you can see <laughs> it is tiny in comparison um, I'll put a can't do that close. Right, I'll stick it there. That's the Titan. So we've got the Hyperion, which is that big. And there's your Titan. Yeah. That is one huge ship. That's going to be... I don't know whether I want to go do it now. <laughs> it's that big. So there you've got your three parts. There's the front section. You can see where it snapped off. The midsection. You can't really see where the midsection snapped off from the rear section. Um, very well. But I assure you it was round about here. And then obviously you've got your rear section. But that's the rear, that's the Titan. Recovered. Made into a... Um, a capital vessel. It does actually fly. It has got a couple of engines on it and it does manoeuvre. Um, <laughs> it was a pain to make. So yeah. Anyway guys, leave it there for today. Um, hope you've enjoyed our little tour of the Hyperion and sheer size of it. Oh, I wanted to go into one of them. I think, see if I can go into one of these before I go I want to go into one of these side, um, side things. Ah, there we go. Ah, get in there. Whoops. And we're in. So jump back off. Jet pack back on because there's no gravity here. And that's basically that's all it is. It's just a, an arm. And I'm presuming all, all of them, all four, will be the same. I thought maybe you'd be able to get down them and, and have a walk around and move around, but no. That is just absolutely phenomenal. So, guys, yep, that's it. Uh, I'll see you next time. Bye-bye uh, for now.